Greetings and welcome to Oro Commerce's video tutorial series. This is Rhonda with Oro Inc. and today I'll be demonstrating how to create shipping promotions in Oro Commerce. Shipping promotions allow you to configure a discount for any of the shipping options configured under Shipping Method Integrations. For more information on how to create shipping method integrations, please see our related videos in the Media Library. All discounts deduct either a specific dollar amount or a percentage off the product or order, depending on the configuration. OroCommerce sellers can add a shipping discount, which is automatically deducted at checkout, or add shipping coupons or other special discounts directly to orders. Buyers can qualify for discounts when coupled with a predefined list of matching qualifying items configured into each promotion. In this tutorial, we'll demonstrate how to configure promotions, create a shipping promotion, and use restrictions. Be sure to check out our other promotion and coupon videos in the Media Library. To configure promotions, navigate to the main system menu and use the drop-down to select Configuration. Expand Commerce. Expand Sales. And click on Promotions. Promotions are enabled by default. You can remove promotions by unselecting the Use Default checkbox and unchecking the Promotions option. For Promotional Strategy, select if you would like the customer to receive the best discount available to them or to combine all discounts that the customer qualifies for. For example, sellers may have four different promotions available on the website and may want to only give one promotion per customer. In this case, they would want the customer to receive the best discount available from the four promotions. Alternatively, there could be a store-wide clearance sale, and in order to move more product and entice customers to purchase more products of different types, they may want to allow the customer to receive and qualify for multiple discounts and would choose to combine all the discounts that the customer qualifies for. After making changes, click the Save Settings button in the top right-hand corner of the screen. Now we'll demonstrate creating promotions. To create a promotion, navigate to the marketing menu and use the drop down to select promotions and then promotions. Click the create promotion button in the top right hand corner of the screen. The owner is pre-populated with the user creating the promotion, but you can change this to another value if necessary. Give the promotion a meaningful name. Since this is a free shipping promotion, we'll call this promotion Free Ship. Give the promotion a sort order. A sort order is used to determine the order that promotions are evaluated for customers. The sort order of 1 would mean this is the highest priority promotion. OroCommerce checks to see if the buyer qualifies for this promotion before checking promotions with a higher sort order number. Click the Enable checkbox to ensure the promotion is enabled. Select the Stop Further Rule Processing checkbox if you wish to stop processing all lower priority promotions once this promotion is encountered. Promotions which stop the processing of additional promotions are usually top priority and have a lower sort order number, in many cases a sort order of 1. Select if you'd like to use coupons for this order. Using coupons means that this promotion can only be used with coupons and the discount will not be deducted at checkout. For more information on how to create coupons, please see the related video in the Media Library. Click on the Discount Options link. Use the drop-down to select a type of discount. For our example, we're creating a free shipping promotion, so we'll use the drop-down to select Shipping. Under the type of discount, use the drop-down to select Fixed Amount or Percentage. For this example, we'll use Fixed Amount. Add a discount value. For our example, our discount will be $10 because that is the price of our flat rate shipping. Use the drop-down to select a currency type. For our example, we'll use US dollar. Under Shipping Method, use the drop-down to select a Shipping Method Integration. As we previously mentioned, you must have created Shipping Method Integrations prior to creating this promotion. Click on the Schedules link. This allows you to schedule a promotion between specific dates and times. For example, you could have a sale that was lasting the entire month of October. If no schedule is listed, the promotion is available immediately. 
You can add additional schedules if necessary by clicking the plus add button. For example, you may want to have weekend sales for the entire month of July. You could then add a schedule for each weekend in July that this promotion would be available for customers. Click the conditions link. Restrictions are used when sellers would like to restrict promotions to a particular website, customer, or customer group. If there are no restrictions, this promotion is available to all customers. In the Expressions field, click the Show link. Use the Expressions field to evaluate customers or products by a particular attribute. For example, you could write an expression which would offer free shipping to VIP customers when they spend over a specific dollar amount. We'll demonstrate expressions later in the tutorial. For more information on writing expressions, please see the information on Expression Language for Promotions in the Oro Commerce Documentation Library. Click on Matching Items. For this example, we're offering free shipping with any purchase, so we're going to select All Store Items. Click the Add button. Check the checkbox to select all items. And click the Add button in the lower right-hand corner of the dialog. We've now added All Store products to this promotion. Click the Save and Close button in the top right-hand corner of the screen. Now we'll return back to the storefront to view this promotion for our guest customer. As you can see, the customer is being charged $10 for shipping. Now that we've added this promotion, we'll reload the page. As you can see, shipping has now been discounted $10. Now we'll demonstrate how to use restrictions with our customer. For this example, we'll edit the free shipping option to allow free shipping for all VIP customers when they purchase over $100 in qualifying products. This means that our customer checking out with the guest option will not be eligible for this promotion, even if they purchase a qualifying amount. Click the Edit button to edit the promotion. Click on the Conditions link. Under Restrictions, use the drop-down to select the VIP customer group. Under Expression, click the Show link and add an expression. For our example, we're offering free shipping for over $100 in product. Click the Save and Close button in the top right-hand corner of the screen. Now we'll return back to our guest customer and reload the page. As you can see, our guest no longer qualifies for the discounted shipping. Now we'll log in with our VIP customer and return back to the shopping list. As you can see, our VIP customer qualifies because she has over $100 in product. Now we'll edit the order. We'll change the amount of product from 10 to 1. As you can see, now that the customer no longer has $100 in product in their shopping list, the shipping discount has disappeared. Thanks for watching. For more video tutorials, please check out our website at www.orocommerce.com slash media dash library and subscribe to our YouTube channel to keep informed of new video tutorials and webinars.